Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to create flexible layouts using AutoFit. AutoFit works almost identically to AutoFill. The only difference is that when the container's size exceeds the size of all the items combined, AutoFill keeps inserting empty rows or columns and pushes your items to the side, while AutoFit collapses these those empty rows or columns and stretches your items to fit the size of the container. Interesting. If your container can't fit all your items on one row, it will move them down to a new one, new one. In the second grid, use auto fit with repeat to fill the grid with columns that have a minimum width of 60 pixels and a maximum of one fraction. Then resize the preview to see the difference. And just once again, we've got a uh, one and two. So um, we're going to be adjusting container two, whereas this one has the same um, code. This is actually a cheat. If you knew this bit of code from the last exercise, then you would be able to um, pass the test just by copying and pasting that. So, but in this one, we're going to adjust the uh, the uh, the second one, meaning these guys right here. And so, what we want to do is set grid template columns. And we want to say repeat, um, fill the grid with columns that have a minimum width, repeat, auto, fit the columns that have a min max of 60 pixels. So at the minimum, there'll be 60 pixels. And at the maximum, there'll be one fraction. Okay, now let's run the test just real quick. Containers should have a grid template columns. Grid tem oh, I know it went wrong. I need to delete that old code. Cool. And so now it looks like they have a maximum of 60 and a minimum. Nice. Okay, let's see if the tests pass. Repeat and auto fit. Repeat, auto, fit. We'll have it with columns that have a minimum of 60 pixels and one fraction. Oh, this needs to be plural. Grid, template, columns. Yikes! I hate errors like that. We run the tests. Okay, cool. And now it says, then resize the preview to see the difference. Now. I can just resize it like this. If I pull this out, you'll see, oh cool, it's auto fit. So I bet once we get under 60, then it pushes it down to the bottom. Huh, auto fit, auto fill. What's the difference between auto fill and auto fit? I can't actually tell. I wonder if I run the test, it'll pass? It passes, hmm, I can't see visually Oh, I see. Okay, auto fit means that once we get, once we stretch it beyond its minimum, it creates a, it, it fits each of the columns. Each of the, yeah, it fits each of the columns to match the fraction. That's why what was so confusing about this one. Oh, in the auto template col columns. Grid template columns, repeat, auto fill, min max 60 pixels and one uh, fraction. So auto fill means that it just fills the space that it's given, I suppose. And then auto fit means it's that they once they get to a certain size, they grow more. I would use auto fit for everything. It seems like it would make more sense. Anyways, uh, if you run the test, you'll see that passes. Hope you guys enjoyed this one and we'll see you in the next lesson.